skill trades are very underrated. It's a great craft to have. I, go, I don't care if it's plumbing, electrical, instrumentation, pipe fitter, millwright. You gotta have, as they say, boots on the ground that are actually going in there, getting the job done, fixing it, figuring out the problem, motivated to come up with innovative ways to fix the problem. At the same time, you're working with your hands going, doing this. You and the team of guys are working with your hands getting this done. You're still able to go to school. You're still able to get your degrees, um, which, is, which is a plus. And you have the infield knowledge that is immeasurable. It's a great first step in the right direction as to what I'm trying to do with my life, to be able to go to school and work at the same time. That's you know something that's hard to find. I've been on what you would call autopilot for so long that I automatically just do things. Now I have to explain why I'm doing what I'm doing, which actually helps me because I remember and I'm oh yeah, that's right. And so that helps me to remember and you know be a better journeyman. Honestly, he's like an uncle. Completely acts like all my uncles. It's like in one person. Since this knowledge that he's given on to me is so out of my league as to what I'm capable of learning on my own. I fall off and he has to come back and catch me and then I catch on just a little bit. You gotta be patient and work with people. So, you know, I can't expect for a guy to come in and be able to pick up on things right away because that's just not the way it works. And that's why, obviously, there's a program put together that's designed for that. It's a challenge in itself because, you know, the beginning of the day and the end of the day, you have a job that you need to um, get done, but at the same time, you're still responsible for another individual that's trying to learn that job and that trade. So you gotta kind of balance your your daily work schedule out, and sometimes it's not gonna be all about just work, trying to get one particular task done. Sometimes you need to take the time out of your working day to make sure that the apprentice is getting information um, that needs to be shared with them uh, in regards to work and how things work in the water industry and what we're doing as instrumentation technicians. I think the best part really is the combination of work and school, you know, to be able to make money and also go to school and then use that money to, you know, pay for that school if you want to. You know, it's, it's really uh, something that you don't find anywhere else. I want to go on and get my degree, of course, and I'm young and I feel like I can do that, but uh, Right now, I want to focus on the program and make sure I get the credits that uh, are included in that and then go on and get my degree. And maybe even one day come back as an engineer for Great Lakes Water Authority. That would be, that'd be really cool.